Hello, everybody. Uh, nice to meet you today. It's my great honor to have a presentation in this nice AAA FM UCLA 2021. My name is Sung Ho Yu from Sehan University in Republic of Korea. The research title is Theoretical optimization of bipatial BIPB module for apartment. The content is, is as follows. First, introduction, research methodologies, and third, target apartment description. First, simulation result, and the last, discussions. A large portion of the energy is used for heating and cooling of building approximately from 25% in Korea to 50% in the USA and 40% in Europe. In Korea, already be built as a new zero energy building for example, 2020 public building over 1,000 square meter, and until 2030, all buildings should be built as a new geology building over 500 square meter floor area. In Europe and the USA, already be built as new zero energy consumption building since the end of 2020. The optimal energy harvesting methodologies, optimal envelope with multifunctional building integrated by patient PV system will be, will be researched, will be simulated, and this research. And a zero energy building as a kind of multifunctional building integrated photovoltaic system will be discussed and will be mathematically analyzed to make an ecological PV envelope system or design criteria close to a zero energy building as a kind of multifunctional building integrated photovoltaic. And Mostly, this research is focused on the ecological use of bipatial PV modules based on the ecological design criteria. This figure shows a special model for building physical information modeling of the solar apartment. This is a this is a overview of a room in a apartment. We can see the in the left side the photovoltaic module as a shade. This is a, a hot point in this research. And through this shading PV system, we can reduce the cooling load of the building enormously and a lot through the lot of reflectance of the solar radiation from the ground or from the wall or the, from the surrounding buildings we can get a lot of solar radiation then the photovoltaic module as a shade they can get a lot of power gen generation multi-purpose use. You can say that. As a teaser, the purpose of this research is to ecologically supply nearly zero energy concepts for a solar apartment. From now on, we can call this type and the NJXA with minimal cost by suggesting the optimal energy harvesting methodologies multifunctional bipatial by PIPB as a shade 
optimum insulation and convergence of radiant cooling system and the PV shade, etc. In the light side, we can see the basic concept of an injector. Through the optimal harvesting methodologies, we can get a lot of uh, power generation and minimum heat loss. And through the maximum heat gain in winter, and maximum elimination in summer. During these processes, we can consider the regional climate and the architectural culture of a, any region in the world to make a nearly zero energy apartment for a human comfort and heating and cooling load reduction. And research methodologies. A high-rise apartment is selected as a target building for an evaluation of a BIPP as a shade in this research. Various variables for building integrated PB systems will be simulated to this high-rise apartment comparison many aspects this is a ecological design criteria of BIPB for solar architecture, from the effective solar radiance to the environmental funness for the sustainability evaluation of the building, exactly speaking, the apartment. This evaluation standard criteria or methodology for the solar architecture Realizing a near zero energy building that our research group has developed has become also an official standard of Korean Solar Energy Society and the Korean Society of Living Environmental System. We can find and the internet homepage here. And the target apartment description. The target apartment is located in the center of this apartment complex in this area and around this floor the, in the ground on the, uh, for example Chinese floor the unit floor plan of the target apartment you can see here this is the living room room one room two in the south side the BIPB system as a shade will be designed as a shade, like this. The section of this apartment, this is the living room, and in the south side, the PB module system as a shade is installed like this, like this on each floor. In summer, the solar radiation is shaded by the oval panel, but winter, solar radiation goes through to the window, to the room. The target solar apartment evaluation method. We use the simulation tool SolCell that we have developed since 2011 to evaluate the solar pattern. The structure of the simulation program, flowchart for BIPB as a shade, we can see here from SolCell that as an input data weather data of a region where the apartment where the building is located and PV data etc. All data for the simulation is input here. And we can calculate we can calculate solar position, diffuse radiance, shade, view factors, total solar radiance, cell temperature, etc. Then we can get a PV power calculation. Target solar apartment evaluation parameters, possible parameters will be input 
and this cool ground. This is the modeling for the apartment as a shade. This is a panel on the on the facade over the window. Length, width, the section of the solar radiation modeling, the light one. And this is the photovoltaic module as a shade. And red line here is a is shown the solar radiance, solar ray, all possible solar rays around the building to arrive at the over surface and the under under surface of the module, reflected radiance, etc. All things the real thing. This was considered by the principle of Eve of the Korean traditional house, the left one here. Very, a lot of merits of the traditional house we can find. All possible parameters of PV module for simulation we can see here from the building latitude, azimuth, longitude, the system type, unit module dimension, PV area, transmittance, depths and thermal conductance of PV cell, absorptance, reflectance of PV cell, etc. etc. All weather varies and reflectance of window ratio ratio of cell in module, etc. All possible parameters will be simulated. And simulation result. For this high rise apartment, 28th floor from 28th floor to 9th floor is installed as a shading, shading PV system. And for the shading PV case and wall attached PV case, was calculated, we can compare with each other. And besides, this power generation through through the shading effects of the PV module we can conserve a lot of energy from 27.5 to 34 percent maximum. This curve is resulted from the shading effect of the PV module. The red curve is apartment cons energy consumption for sh shading effect the black one is a non-shading case. This is enormous one. That's very interesting thing in this research. And uh, we have calculated, simulated year-round long, year-round, depending on the angle of the PV from 0 degree to 90 degree of PV angle. The optimum angle was 13.5 degree, but considering the traditional architecture of eaves in of traditional architecture, we can deploy the angle of 23.5 degree, but the uh, efficiency difference was. 4.6 percent, but the ethical point of view, this is reasonable. This is the power generation depending on PV module type, single bipatial reflectance difference, and uh, etc. This we can find a interesting result from the depending on the reflectance of cell in the case of 0 0.1 and 0 0.2, single facial, bifacial, the efficiency was different each other. And the system usage rate comparison depending on the VIP system meta apartment. For the shade type, the average system usage rate was 17.6 percent, but the wall attached type usage rate was 
just 9.5% because of the uniform system usage day usage rate of uh, this shading type. And discussions. The main interest of BIPB research is improving multifunctional use of BIPB module to reduce the cost of power generation and building energy conservation is an important one. The ecological design criteria of BIPB are essential for a high-rise apartment building. Bipatial BIPB module as a shed can produce 12% additional power output in comparison to compare conventional monopatial VIPB. The influence of the bipatial VIPB module, the tractance on power generation is approximately 0.9 percent point, much more than one of the monopatial PB modules. The system usage rate of wall attached PB system demonstrates the seasonal big difference but shows just 5.4% in June. The irreversible system usage rate is low, also low for these reasons, corresponding to 9.5%. The high system usage rate of inclined PV system functions as a shape demonstrates a uniform distribution all year long. The increased power output caused by the uniform system usage rate of the inclined by pH of PV system is 46% more than one of the wall attached PV system. Besides this added output of power generation, through the sun shading effect of this kind of BIPD system as a shade, during the cooling period, the cooling load of the corresponding building is approximately reduced by 27.6 to 34 percent. Solar architecture integrated photovoltaic system should be designed multi purpose ways which can generate electricity and act as a shade and a cooling period at a high, hot climate zone. The last, it is necessary to examine the other variables that affect power generation building energy consumption, and occupant comfort through parameter simulation during the design process to make a sustainable solar architecture in the future. Thank you for your attention.